Greetings dudes, and uh, welcome to the uh, latest Quest for Tone review, and in this episode we'll be doing the uh, small and mighty, and a very common, Marshall MG15, and this particular one is the CDR. The Marshall MG15 CDR has two channels, a clean channel and an overdrive channel, both of which are controlled by a three band EQ consisting of bass, contour and treble. On this particular model, there is also a reverb, but there's also a DFX version which has a multitude of effects including delay, flanger and chorus. What we also have on the front panel is the FDD button which features on all Marshall MG series, a CD in an emulated line out and also if you're shredding at midnight it also has a headphone output. This amp is rated at 15 watts, so it's really just a simple solid state practice amp. So, um, here's some clean stuff. channel demo I was using the coil tap on my ML1 so I was using the middle pickup and one outer coil from the bridge pickup humbucker. Now the clean channel is controlled by, by a three band EQ which is shared with the overdrive channel and um, all the settings were roughly at midnight with a, a bit more bass and a bit less treble because it's quite a bright amp but a uh, good clean tone nevertheless. Now we'll move on to the overdrive channel. Now uh, this has the same three band EQ which is shared with the clean channel and has a gain and volume. So um, I'll show a few rock riff tones, then some metal tones and then a bit of blues. <laughs> again a bit on the overdrive channel and I'll uh, show you some filthy blues tones so um, here's a few <laughs> So uh, finally, here is some uh, metal tones from the MG15 with the gain up a bit, and um, take a listen. <laughs> Oh, my God. 
MG is one of the small beginner amps of the MG range and this one is rated at 15 watts and is a simple solid state amplifier. Now um, I should imagine pretty much every guitar player at some point has at least played one of these amplifiers and most likely owned one. And normally the first amp you ever get and uh, people often shift them in the corner and uh, as they upgrade for other amps and uh, people just don't don't like them but for a practice amp or a, an amp that you're going to use in your home instead of you using your six foot tall valve amp I think they're perfect 15 watts not loud you've got two channels you can put your foot pedals in front of it if need be and uh, you don't need perfect valve sound quality when you're practicing at home so uh, get yourself one of these bad boys if you do need to practice at home. So um, one last thing I um, wanted to show you before we uh, leave today is a recording that my friend Sam the Jelly Man has done and I uh, believe it or not the overdrive on this recording is simply the clean channel with the volume on full whack. Believe it or not that's all it is, no overdrive pedals, nothing straight in the amp with volume full whack so um, I'll play you out of that and I hope you've enjoyed this review I'll see you guys soon and uh, take it easy and don't forget to subscribe